Good evening, everybody. Another Benchy. <laughs> um, yeah, this time it's it's not going to be a race challenge. It's going to be a mix between some speed and some quality. So it's been sliced with uh, normal settings, which means uh, two walls, uh, three bottom, three top. And layer height instead of 0.25 for that speed challenge, 0.2. Which should gives us, uh, it should give us a bit more quality, resolution, and there's nothing optimized like my my slicing for the speed bench sheet. Meaning that, as you can see, it's printing 45 degree angle in fill. Uh, it's also set to 15% in fill instead of 10, which should give give a, a better base for laying the um, the top layers. And other than that, it's been sliced. Uh, some some areas are at 250, like uh, infill, millimeters per second. Some are 100, like uh, outer walls. Some are 200. Acceleration is set to uh, 5,000. And corner speed is set to 5. So that would be, I, I would qualify that as normal printing speed for a, a, a normal printer. So this is the, the first attempt, the first run that I do. Um, this is ABS eSun, ABS Plus. I honestly have not tried to print that slow um, with that printer yet. I mean, yes, with that printer, but not with that setup, with the Magnum, with the O-Drive. So it, it's gonna be interesting to see. Um, so it should print for 20 minutes or so. So I'm not gonna talk throughout the, the 20 minutes. So I'll just uh, fast forward the video for you and I'm gonna show you the end result and hopefully we're, we're, we're gonna get a good quality Benchy. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a good quality Benchy. So let's find out.
right, print is over. Let's see the result. Oh, I'm just gonna close the fans. What about the chimney? Not too bad, I guess. Could be better, but this was printed with ABS. Let's see, do we see the steering wheel? Oops. So that was it. It can be better. I guess if I try with PLA, might be a better candidate for better quality. But this is not too bad. So that was it. Um, as requested, Benchy outer walls at 100 millimeters per second, like people wanted to see. I'm pretty sure we can get better wall quality with higher speed, like maybe 200. Um, I'm just by experience with the the old drive system um, though there's I mean qualities there there's it's it's pretty good as is but I'm pretty sure if we crank the speed to double that 200 uh, we're gonna get the same or better quality so I see no point of printing at a hundred millimeters per second but people wanted to see that so here it is on this folks have a great night bye bye